write uh, more sketch oriented. I've been really trying to spend a lot of time with pencil and paper. In, in the age of computers, I think it's a, there's a big danger of writing to make the computer sound good. Once you get into the computer, you're out of your imagination. I, I'm a really guide tone oriented writer when it comes to writing melody, or certainly over functional harmony. Everything hinges on this very melodic line inherent in, you know, the line can bounce up and down, but the one thing I do is just sketch out a guide tone, an interesting guide tone. I mean, not necessarily one that contains just thirds and sevenths, but I like guide tones that, I love guide tones that go up. One thing that really helps me, it's sort of an exercise, is that I immerse myself in, uh, in music that I really love. So I'll, oftentimes my, like, one of my tunes is based on the bridge to inner urge, or the, you know, the last eight bar to inner urge. Starting from a place of real structure, like especially from a tune I like and play a lot, uh, a standard or, or a tune, you know, a jazz standard like a Joe Henderson tune, um, it often, the, the results are really cool. Tunes come from anywhere. They, they can come from a harmony, they can come from rhythm, they can come from, uh, from melody. The inception of a tune doesn't need, it doesn't need to be a lot. It, just need, it can be one tiny little idea, really simple with some emotional impact and to the point. Something that feels good to you.